journalists who believe they are the eyes and ears of society, never imagining what that might do to their minds. It's also about a growing wave of journalists who understand that trauma journalism can be dangerous and emotionally devastating. And it's about how they came here to New Orleans. I'm one of them. We understand that breaking news can break news. I once had a trauma specialist tell me, in order to put something behind you, you must first put it in front of you, examine it, and come to terms with it. This film has helped me do that. That napkin sent me on a journey. I found out about the Dart Center, Dart Oxford Fellowships, and the Dart Society. And in the process, I found myself. The Dart Center collects the resources that journalists need to deal with the themes of trauma and tragedy and cruelty. The Dart Society are those journalists who have those needs and have gone the extra mile and, and want to set a standard. What they do is they gather these journalists together each year, and it's a shared experience, and many of them talk about uh, different events or episodes in their lives. Lloyd Brinker obviously had been to a number of war zones. Uh, there were a couple of war correspondents there, but there were also local journalists who'd gone through some pretty tough stuff. Bringing together a community, and it's a, it's a community of journalists uh, in pain, but, but we're finding a way forward. It's a story about people, the people who care enough to come here and contribute, the people who care enough about a city that they refuse to leave or to give up. This is a story about the strength of the human condition. To put it simply, it's a story of hope.